Fear is not real. The only place that fear can exist is in our thoughts of the future. It is a product of our imagination, causing us to fear things that do not at present and may not ever exist. That is near insanity, Katar. Now, do not misunderstand me. Danger is very real, but fear is a choice. We are all telling ourselves a story. Great moments are born from great opportunities. And that's what you have here. Our deepest fear is not that we are inadequate. Our deepest fear is that we are powerful beyond measure. It is our light, not our darkness, that most frightens us. Your playing small does not serve the world. There is nothing enlightened about shrinking so that other people won't feel insecure around you. We were all meant to shine as children do. It's not just in some of us, it's in everyone. And as we let our own light shine, we unconsciously give other people permission to do the same, as we are liberated from our own fear. Our presence automatically liberates others. When you guys find a fear, that fear will either create you or destroy you. I love fear. The reason why, behind every fear is a person you want to be. Fear is self-imposed, meaning it doesn't exist. You create it, you can destroy it too. Spartans! What is your profession? Get up! Your mama needs you, your daddy needs you, your children need you, your community. Get up! Your wives gonna push you when you can't push yourself. When you wanna quit and give up, your wives gonna give you that edge you need, that advantage you need, that, that lift that you need to get to the next level. Your wife! To be able at any moment to sacrifice what you are for what you will become. That's called courage. Now that's the stuff leaders should be made. When you guys find a fear, that fear will either create you or destroy you. You know, when you're tough and you're strong, people think nothing will break you. But if enough stuff happens, back to back to back to back, eventually you say, Lord, even I can't take no more of this. The impulse to dream has been slowly beaten out of me through the experience of life. You can either live your dreams or live your fears. And I think the majority of people actually are not living their dreams, but are living their fears. Big mental thing there, guys. This body is great as you are, as sharp as you make the arsenal. It can't do anything if you don't have confidence in yourself. We all fall down in life. The question is, who gets back up?